my gosh. Reactions like this. Oh, what is that? That's the sun. Oh my God. Are out of this world. You think like a part of it's gonna fly off and get you. Thanks to the Adler Planetarium's Scopes in the City program. It's an opportunity to expand our reach into neighborhoods and places where other people might not have access to the planetarium all the time. Adriana Guzman and other members of the Adler team bring telescopes to libraries like here at the Chinatown branch and to tap rooms. The sites are in the city and suburbs with more than a dozen viewing opportunities still left this summer. During the daytime we'll be looking at the sun, but we also have night observing events where we might look at the moon, Jupiter, Saturn, Mars, whatever's up in the sky that we can see from the city. Craters and rings included. At Scopes in the City, you can do more than just look up at outer space. How about holding a piece of it in your hands? Like with this fragment of the moon that's more than 2 billion years old, or this chunk of the red planet. And there's more Mars fun just days away, when it moves the closest it's been to Earth in the past 15 years. Even a small telescope, it's going to be so much brighter than it usually is. You can already see it really bright in our night sky, so it's going to be exciting to get a closer look. For the Mars Close Approach, Adler hosts a special viewing event Monday, July 30th from 9 to 11 p.m. With, you guessed it, plenty of telescopes and eyes to the sky. Jesse Kirsch, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.